Welcome to Two Minutes with Mike, where I try to blow your noodle in the time it takes to make my noodle. If you read 1 Corinthians 12 and Romans 12, those passages tell us that we are one body with many parts. And each part must fulfill its own role in order for the whole body to function effectively. We desperately need each and every one of us. Now, when I heard this as a young man, I tried to figure out what the part of the body I was. What were my gifts and abilities? Where could I be used? In the end, I concluded that I wasn't an arm, I wasn't a mouth, I wasn't an eye. I concluded I was the appendix. Why? Because nobody is quite sure what the appendix does. It's something that is ignored and forgotten about until it causes problems. It's then removed as soon as possible and nobody really misses it when it's gone. That's what I honestly believe about myself. But of course, it wasn't true. I really believed that I couldn't make a meaningful contribution to the body, but that was a lie. Fortunately, that thinking has changed over the years, and I'm really thankful that the Lord has seen fit to use even me, despite my weaknesses and my flaws. Now, some parts of the body may be more prominent than others. Some may be more visible, but there are no unimportant parts of the body. If one small part doesn't work, the whole body suffers. Indeed, the Bible says that the so-called weaker parts we should treat with even more honor. So the most important thing isn't how visible you are or how gifted you are. It's more about how willing you are and whether you are playing the part that you were designed to play and whether in that you are attached to the head Christ along with the rest of the body. So I want to say this, if you're not sure what you are, if you're not sure what part of the body you are or what your gifts are, try experimenting. Dare to step out and try. You have an important part to play. You are not an appendix. Step out and see how you can be a part of the whole body working better. Time's up. See you soon.